A fiery reminder for some in Marysville of a forgotten historic district. It comes after the landmark Marysville Hotel caught fire overnight on Saturday. Your reporter Madison Keevy is covering Yuba County tonight. She's joining us live with more. Madison. Yeah, just a couple days after that fire in this quiet downtown that's still closed to traffic because of safety concerns at that hotel, a break in across the street at, as a historical landmark as the hotel and the owner there says it's a sign of a bigger problem. Don Melvin is the keeper of Marysville history. At least he could be. Last 24 hours I've been coming here often to see if somebody broke in because of the fire at the hotel. He owns the historic State Theater, built in 1927, a year after its now burned out neighbor, the Hotel Marysville. We met Melvin in the middle of a fix up. I really don't want to see, you know, it burnt like that hotel. Overnight, an attempted break in. In the process, vandals destroyed a steel door and damaged several others. So I'm really worried that whoever lit that hotel has a similar idea for this. This stretch of town was the place to be back in the day. The Hotel Marysville, the place to stay. Opened in 1926 and it attracted everyone from Lou Gehrig and Babe Ruth to Hollywood icon Bing Crosby. Now abandoned and empty. Engulfed in flames Saturday, its fiery end recorded. Protecting what's left of history, Melvin says, feels like it's up to him with no help from the city. I was immediately worried about this because it's in similar you know, circumstances to that hotel. Yeah, now there aren't any lights on the State Theater. The marquee isn't lit up, but that does not mean that no one is there. Melvin tells us that he is doing patrols even tonight around the building to make sure that piece of history goes untouched.